Hey guys, welcome. And today we are on our cousin's YouTube channel. And today we are going to be showing you 10 products that she recommends for new mothers. The first product is an automatic bouncer and is by Ingenuity and it is $50 at Target and $60 on Amazon. So this bouncer is different from any other bouncers in that it's automatic. Uh, you don't see that in any other bouncer. So uh, Ingenuity makes a bouncer that's automatic. It is battery operated, which you might be steered away from, but um, it's lasted me three or four weeks already, so um, without a battery change, so it lasts pretty long. Um, I know previous bouncers that my sister had and other people had, you had to sit there and bounce it with your foot or your hand, bounce it yourself, um, but this one, uh, it bounces by itself, so it's pretty sweet. That's why I recommend it. Product number two is a wet dry bag by Skip Hop. It is $15 and you can find it on Amazon. Okay, so the thing I like about this bag is that um, it has a dry portion which you would put your two, you know, three outfits in. So uh, if they have a blowout anywhere you go, you have always a change of clothes. And then when they do have a blowout, you put that in the wet portion of the bag. So um, it is made out of plastic, you can easily wipe it clean, so if there's anything wet or poopy, then you can stick it in there. Um, also like it, um, it's something you can easily stick in your diaper bag, and um, I like organization, so it helps you organize instead of just throwing uh, outfits in there, clean or dirty, so organization. The third product is a breast pump, and it is by Hakka, but my cousin, she got it from another brand like Blue Moon or anyone else. Um, it is $14, and uh, Blue Moon is $10 on Amazon. So the Hakka I was turned on to by Shayna, shout out to Shayna, and Christine had mentioned it as well. Um, it is a breast pump, a manual breast pump, that um, you can either manually breast, you know, pump your breasts like if you're on the go, which I really haven't done or don't need to do, um, or you can put it on one breast when the baby is latched to the other, and it'll catch the letdown. So um, you can catch, you know, three ounces sometimes with this. Um, so it's good to build up your storage. Um, so I got um, a different brand. This was the Blue Moon brand. It was ten bucks. Um, the Hakka brand is fourteen dollars. That's like the name brand. Um, there's really no difference in it, um, but I did find that with the Blue Moon version that was 10 bucks, I got a, t a lid and um, it comes with like a holder so that it doesn't fall over. Um, I bought my sister the Hakka brand and it didn't come with any of that, so um, I recommend the Blue Moon version. The fourth product is a, a changing pad slash scale by Hatch Baby that you can find on Amazon for $130. But if you go to Bye Bye Baby, you can use a 20% off coupon. So the Hatch Baby is a scale and changing pad in one. Um, I was getting frustrated with our normal changing pad. Um, yeah, it's warm and cozy and it has the fabric, but uh, Austin likes the caca a lot. Um, she caca like three times in a row, pee bead. Um, so I found myself doing way more laundry. Um, I would be up in the middle of the night washing and scrubbing the caca off of the, you know, yeah, I have a, a little cover that I would put on them, but I would be running through those covers and sometimes she would make it onto, you know, the actual changing pad cover itself. Um, I'd be washing that way too many times and um, it was kind of, every time I changed her diaper, I was just so scared and I would wait you know, to see if she would gaga and not, you know, it just took so long and I was uh, frustrated with the, you know, normal changing pads. So I saw the Hatch Baby changing pad, which is one that you can, um, it's just made out of kind of rubbery foam. Um, you can wipe it down real easy if she has any accidents. Um, when I do lay her down, I do put a, um, a burp cloth or something under her head so that her head isn't cold when I lay her down in the middle of the night, um, but it uh, gives me uh, peace of mind, a lot more, a lot less anxiety when I'm changing a diaper. Um, and so I do recommend the Hatch Baby 
um, changing fat and it is a scale as well so I did use the scale portion of it I uh, weighed Austin before and after her feedings to know how much she was eating so that way I know how much to store and give her and feed her in a bottle um, you can also weigh her and see how much she's progressing and gaining um, not too much because we don't want a giant although my family does want a giant um, but she yeah it is very useful I do recommend the hatch baby scale Product number five is a shisher, and it's by Baby Shisher, and it is $35 on Amazon. So the Baby Shisher I saw on a blog um, someone else recommended, and I got it. Um, basically, um, you can bring this on the go, uh, put in your diaper bag. It is a little guy that basically says shh the whole time. And um, it definitely works in helping Austin uh, go to sleep or feel calm. Uh, my aunts think that I'm real lazy and I don't want to say shh myself, but sometimes you don't want to shh for like 20 minutes. So this is very useful. I don't care if you call me lazy or not. That is why we want these products because we are lazy. Product number six is a sleeping pod by Swaddle Me. You can find the sleeping pods at TJ Maxx and Amazon for only $10, but you can also find them at Target for $20. So uh, my mom had brought me these. Um, she had actually found two for $10 at TJ Maxx. Um, they're little, basically, um, swaddle pods. Um, I really like them. They are zipper, which is a lot more easier than you know wrapping your baby up um, every diaper change at night. Um, and it also zippers from the bottom. Um, so when you do have to do that diaper change, they're still um, bundled up. And so they don't wake up as easily or get cold or mad. Um, so you just unzip from the bottom, do the quick diaper change, zip back up. Um, I also like that she is able to put her hands here if she wants. She can put them here. She can put them down straight. And I've seen her um, also all three of those ways, but mostly like this. So I like these a whole lot better than the uh, Velcro swaddles, um, which Swaddle Me also makes. Um, those are very loud in the middle of the night um, when you take the Velcro off um, to do the diaper change so that it wakes them up and startles them. Um, they also, you know, you have to take them completely out of the swaddle in order to change their diaper. So um, that makes them cold and wakes them up. So um, I highly recommend these, um, you are um, able to do the zip from the bottom. Uh, you can also get two for 10 on Amazon, uh, but the boy versions, I see them for like two for 20. So it just depends on if you get a deal or not. So the thing about this is that it only comes in newborn size. So it's up to 14 pounds or 24 inches, something like that. Um, so I'll be sad once she grows out of this. Um, I'm gonna stick her in it as long as I can. Here's the seventh product, and it is by Dr. Brown's, and you can get three for 16, and you can get one for five. So I was turned on to the Dr. Brown's bottles by Shayna. Um, I did previously have Tommy Tippy bottles, but Austin was spilling milk all over herself. Um, she was either like super hungry when she was taking the bottle, um, or even when she's chilling, it's just spilling all on the sides of her mouth and onto herself. Um, Shayna said that this was a lot more slower flow. Um, so even if you buy the lowest, uh, you know, slow flow of Tommy Tippy, it's still spilling. Um, this does a lot better uh, on her and it is slow flow. So I'll be using these until, you know, she gets a little older then hopefully the Tommy Tippy bottles will be okay. Product number eight is a bottle sanitizer by Bala Bebe. It is $70 on Amazon. So at the beginning, I didn't think I needed a bottle sanitizer, um, but then I got mastitis and read up that you need to sterilize your baby's bottles, your pump parts, and your uh, baby's pacifiers. So uh, that next day, I ordered this on Amazon. Um, it was actually on sale on the Amazon Prime Day sale, um, $20 off, so I did get it for $50. 
Um, this is actually a sanitizer and dryer all in one. Um, I really liked it because most of the bottle sanitizers are huge like this. This is pretty huge, you know. You don't want this on your countertop all the time. This one actually has the option of taking this piece off and making it half the size so that you could just do a few items and keep it on your countertop like this. Um, store that into storage. Um, but you do have the options if you if you do have a bunch of bottles to clean, you do have the option to put that, you know, make it huge and have everything fit in there. So I really like that. Um, also, um, I am lazy and don't want to wait for things to dry. Um, you know, that also contributes to more bacteria when it is drying, you know, when it's sitting on the countertop. So this is a dryer as well. So um, it takes an hour in total for the sanitizer and drying, um, but it does dry it for you and once it's done, everything's ready to go and use. The ninth product is a baby carrier and it's by Baby Catan and you can get it for $60 on Amazon. The tenth and final product is this baby carrier by Ergo Baby. You can find this carrier at Amazon for $160, but you can also find it at any local baby store. So I'll talk about both of the baby carriers at once since I do have two of them. This one I did get for free from Corey and Cherie since they uh, never used theirs. They said I can have it. Um, it is the number one baby carrier out there um, on all of the lists. It is ergonomical since, you know, hence the name. Um, it's good for your back, good for the baby's uh, body as well. Uh, it, you do have to buy a, I think it's about 20, 25 bucks for the baby um, infant insert, a little seat that they sit on. Uh, but it is very stable and I do like this one more for when I go out and about um, when I'm, you know, out of the home. The other one I did end up buying because it is a lot more comfortable. So it's more for the house. So I do recommend this over any other wrap. Um, the other wraps I know are hard to figure out and you know they can come loose. This is basically two pieces already put together for you, easy to put on. The only bad thing about this is that you do have to buy it to your size. So if your husband and yourself are a different size, you will need to buy two different ones. Um, but that is why uh, you know it's not adjustable like the other ones. If you can figure out the other ones, then cool. But this one, I will demonstrate for you real quick to show you how easy it is. Put it around like a scarf, it's the two pieces. Um, you put your arms through like an X and the one in the front, you're gonna put around down by your waist. And then you put the baby in. So let's use this little unicorn I have on hand as your baby. Put them in, well, you wanna face them to you. And so they're secure, put their feet in, or when they're older, you can have their feet hanging out. And then you just take this second piece that you put on the bottom, you bring it on up onto your shoulder, adjust it to where it's under them. This is a very tiny baby. Um, and that is all. Um, so easy as that. Um, I do like this one in the house because you can sit down, lounge on the couch. It's, it's fabric so it's a lot more comfortable. This one is a Baby Catan Baby Breeze so the fabric has holes, it's kind of like mesh. So it is um, breathable for them, um, less hot, it's good for the summertime. But it also has the option to switch it around and use the full um, fabric version. So in the winter when you need a little bit more warmth, um, that is, you know, you can switch to that side. So it's very easy. It does have do, um, different positions you can put the baby in. Um, it does get really warm because your baby is so close to you on your body. So um, I do switch to the other one if I'm really hot and um, want a little bit more airflow. I do use the other one. Um, also, if Austin doesn't want to have her head, you know, 
laying on me because right now that she can't control her head, it basically has to be in in here and laying on me. If she wants to be kind of looking around, I use the other one. So um, I do like having both. Um, it's very, they're both useful in their own ways. Um, I use this one mainly at home and that one um, I used while in the hospital because it's, you know, 110 degrees outside. So I didn't want to be hot and I used the other carrier. It's a lot more structured, um, just depends on what kind you like. But if you're going for the wrap kind of carrier, this is the way to go. It's, it's very easy to figure out. So that concludes our recommended products. Make sure you like, subscribe, and comment down below what your favorite products are or what products you recommend for us. <laughs>